look. Look. Say cheese or say hi to the camera. It's recording. What? Yes, I'm recording this whole thing. I have to make a whole bunch of vlogs, remember? Again, sorry for that rude interruption. Hello, the car door was stuck and we couldn't, well, you know, open it. Anyways, we were going to get some cat carriers at PetSmart, but they couldn't, but they were like expensive. I'm talking $30, $29, 20 yeah, $20, $30. And we're thinking, you know what, it's a little bit over our budget right now because we're moving. And my mom's thinking, okay. Of course, we're going to stick the cats in the same car at the same time. And from that, Boots and Lucky have been having some issues. Every time Lucky gets near, Boots growls. Or, not really hisses, but growls. Like a little noise. Yeah, I'm not really fond of them fighting, but oh well. And, um, every time, yeah. Lucky it just goes along with the flow and tries to go and beat up Boots or they try, so they just, you know, play and try to beat up each other. Oh, I'm talking too much for no reason. Sorry about that. Um, anyways, we know, so we're going to try to keep them in pet carriers, which we're, we, we, but we definitely know they're not going to be too happy about that, but, you know, oh well, you know, just to get them to the house and junk. I mean, I look, I'm, you know, just starting to notice, but. I bet those little bit, those little dogs and the and cats being cat carriers and dog, little mini dog carriers. I don't think that they're pretty happy about that because heck, I would not be too happy either if I had to go and be shielded off from the world just like just you know um sitting there. I can raise my head because it would hit the roof. Just being in that tiny confined space, you know. But you know, oh well, things happen. And oh, this is to you if you actually, um, this is to my floor. If this guy's, I'm gonna go search him down. Find who, find out who he is. And look at his MySpace or Facebook or whatever, Twitter, you know. And I'm gonna go and, cause we were at the Red Dragon. Was it, it's Red Dragon. Chine, Chinese Red Dragon Red Dragon Chinese restaurant. It, yeah, anyways. Some drunk guard well, he was um going in oh it's saying he it ends up he goes there like all the time but he's always drunk, insulting the um waitress for no reason. He was like, Oh, I let you ignore this and he did. And then he goes and says, Oh hey, come here boy and to this kid um, I think he just, grad he just graduated from high school, but he was like saying, saying, being all nice to him, and then once he le once he turns, literally, one the moment he turns his back, he always starts talking um all this shit about him. So I'm like, my mom was, especially her, she was like, I want to kick his butt. I was like, Mom, just don't, just ignore it, just ignore it. No one's, we, no one's, it's you know, it's bad to go and start a fight, and especially in a restaurant, seriously. So, you know, anyways, pleasant part, once we left, um, like, right when we were leaving, the guy, he's like, he comes, he sees me, uh, sees us at the registry, he's like, oh, River Valley, because, um, my name tag, go River Valley High School, um, and he's like, oh, River Valley sucks, I was like, not even, he was like, Mojave High School, and then I was like, no, River Valley, and he was like, it sucks. I was like, oh yeah, Mojave has AIDS, and my mom, she like, turns out, she's like, what? Did you just say Mojave has AIDS? I was like, yeah. So the whole time while we were in the parking lot, even as we were getting in the car, Mojave sucks. River Valley sucks. Mojave. River Valley. 
I would laugh my butt off, but it was hilarious and <laughs> more girls. I think I know her. Oh my god, I'm friends with her. I don't think I would be friends with her if I didn't know her. And I started filming people, you know, like Shane Dawson and Helga Kay and sometimes Brendan Lee Taylor, how they do. Um, when they're talk about people, like, uh, hey, I just need to be right now, like, see those people over there? Oh, close up, close up, and we back away. Yeah, like that? I should probably do that, huh? Like, oh, oh, look, look at that lady, OMG, she's pretty. Hold on. <laughs> Anyways, oh. Um, I've been having some issues with my boyfriend. Not, don't, okay, you know, it's sort of hard to go and talk about this to my mom because we we have this thing go, you know, if, the boy, if you're dating someone, how they should always treat you with respect and all this, and I gotta go, I'll tell you less later. Hey, before I continue what I'm saying, I'm just gonna say this. Mom, you... Need to, you know, I'm just tearing your wallet from now on. Hi, and this is why she came into um, Ross looking for a cat carrier. And this is what she came out with. A little picture. I don't know if I can't remember what's her name, but. Yeah, she came out with that little thing and with it. $20. I do not know what to say. Here we are. This is like all these shopping centers. Yes. Target. Okay. Target. Thank you. Okay. Mr. Carl, get back here. Oh, you guys are yours. Okay. I have to go talk to you. Okay. Another video.